Hello there everyone, this is Patty and I am here in Wilmington, North Carolina with my friend Emmy. Uh, we came here to go to the battleship and we found this beautiful um, 1800s bed and breakfast that we're staying at um, for two nights. But right down the street from it is this old cemetery. We had to come in here. Look at this. Check this out. It's a very old cemetery and we decided to go ahead and kind of go through here and look around and you never know what we might see in here. This is so beautiful. And it's right next door to that church right there. Eighteen thirty seven, aged eleven years. So this was an eleven year old here. My goodness, eighteen thirty seven. These are some very old graves. Now we've been getting the word sacred on our um, spirit app that we use. We've been getting that word quite a bit. And um, I'm seeing the word sacred a lot in this town and uh, especially here at this cemetery. Look at this, sacred. Everything says sacred. 18th, 1814, age 32 years old. In November. Aww. The tribute to Christina. Daddy. Wow. Eighteen oh eight. Holy moly. The, oh my goodness. This person here was born in seventeen ninety six. Died at thirty seven years old. A native of Scotland, Andrew Clark. A merchant of Fayetteville, who departed this life September 23rd, 1796, 37 years old. Wow. There's another one. The memory of James. Um, looks like part of that's missing there. It's weird. Um... 30, uh, 54 years old. 1808. These are some old graves, Emmy. Yeah, did you see the ones on the other? I know, I need to go over there. Yeah. But this one here said this person was born in 1796. Really? Yes. I know. 1837. This person died in 1837. They were 42 years old. Wow. 1837. This is beautiful. I think we're all And I have Emmy with me. Hey, I got Patty. From the G hey. <laughs> wow. Yep, there's a little tiny one right there. I think it's beautiful how they're keeping your memories alive. This is so nice what they've done here. So they take pretty pretty good care of the tombstones in the area here. 
Some of these you just can't even read. Oh, it's on this side. 1816. 200 years ago. Over 200 years ago. Wow. 1799. Look at this one. 27 years old in 1792. Mary uh, Claypool? Looks like Claypool. These are some very old graves. 1788. Died at 18 years old. People didn't live very long back then. Here lies the body of James Corin Esk. See. Well, died the tenth, no, the twentieth, died the okay. Died the twentieth day of August 1799 aged 32 my goodness wow this is amazing to see this i'm so glad we found this it's literally two blocks from where we're staying There's some little stones there 1829 I've never seen anything like this. There's just bricks built up over top of them. There's another one over here. Yeah, it's true. in here so old eighteen nineteen huh what really yeah there's a lot of them that are eighteen eighteen what is that flashing light over there that's what scared me it's a light that's aiming at the building Oh, okay. I keep hearing whispering. You don't hear whispering? Unless it's you or you... I said, wow. Oh, maybe I you heard you. I, I don't you know. Turn around going. I don't know. I heard something. I sniffled. <laughs> you know where I get there? Go over there. Yeah? Yeah. Like, you get a feeling over here? That area. Well, hello. We are real close to an airport. Eighteen eighteen, yep. Wow. So I'm assuming this church has been here probably since the eighteen hundreds too, you think? We need to look up the history of this church. But it looks very old. You get a feeling like somebody's watching Yes, I get a feeling like somebody's definitely watching. 
I just turned I, my, camera my camera off. Was on. Your camera was on. And I, I just, didn't even touch this. It said. It won't even tell us. It said it listening, on. and then it said paranormal. That's what I heard it That's say. That's what I heard, and I think. And you caught that too. on camera. Yeah, my hands were like. Maybe you can give me that footage so yes. I can add it to my video. Oh my god. Because I just turned it off so I could set up my, you know, my light on here because it's starting to get dark, and all of a sudden this came on by itself, and it said listening, In my pocket. and then it said paranormal. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> We're like so funny. I know. I've always had a fascination with planes. I don't know what it is. That's crazy. I mean, I'm afraid to turn my camera back off now. Um, well, um, you know when you're with me, you can't have it off. You gotta have it well, on. I was trying to, I was gonna hook this up, you know, so that I'd have my lights. It's starting to get dark. Okay, I finally got my light hooked up here. And her thing is Luke. going off. What's it saying? Loop. Loop? Yes. Emmy, I'm telling you, it said listening and it said paranormal. paranormal. I heard. Look, I'm not even near that. Lord. Lord, okay. Coin. Yeah. We believe in the Lord. Coin. Coin. How many spirits are out here with us right now? Do you want to tell us? You guys have been here a long time. It's been over 200 years for a lot of you since you've passed away. Scale. Scale. My name is Patty and this is Emmy. Can you say either one of our names? Hi. I just heard a whisper again. What? I thought I heard a whisper. My tape recorders are in the car. My voice recorders? Work. Work? Was this church here when you died? Village. Village? Village. Okay. Knock. Knock. You want to knock on something? You gonna maybe you could knock for us somewhere. My camera battery is already dying. No way. We just started filming. Oh my god. Something is draining it. I'm gonna have to go to the car and get another battery. Oh my god. Oh, I just heard that again. It's like a whisper. Well, you know what? I'll walk to the car with you, but I'll leave this here because there's only one way in. Yeah, that's true. We'll leave this here. We'll both walk away because I want to get my voice recorder, okay? Okay. So let's do that. All right, we're going to walk to the car so I can change my battery. Okay, just change my battery out. And uh, I think we're good to go. I'm gonna head back over here now. Emmy left her camera rolling and everything. I hear it going off. There's a lot of people with the last name Claypool here. Francis Wilkinson. Holly Claypool. Latita Robinson. OK, 
Okay, let's get back over here and see what this is saying. Uh-oh. That heater is on. It's going to make it kind of loud. We might have to postpone filming for just a couple minutes until it goes off. What's it say? Alcohol. Bedroom and then alcohol. Okay. Okay, the heater has now went off, so, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and turn my camera back on. But this thing's been talking away. Emmy caught it all on her camera right over here that she had running the whole time we walked away and everything. How many spirits are out here with us tonight? Can you tell us? Soil. I just put my hand down in the dirt. You did? I did. I went back like this. See? Mm-hmm. We're going to go ahead and move because there's people over there inside. And we don't want them to come out and question us as what as to what we're doing out here i mean the gates are open if it, if they didn't want anybody back here they would have them closed so i don't really think it's a big deal but you know when they see all of our equipment and cameras they're going to start asking questions and some people just don't understand or don't believe I'm just trying to think of where to go. Yeah, there's a bench over there. You get a very peaceful feeling here. Okay, Emmy has the Alice on again. Can. Can? Can. Oh, can. So what do you think about how much the world has changed since you've been here 200 years ago for a lot of you? Stream. another one. Look how foggy it is out. So we must be very close to the Wilmington Airport. I did. Is there anybody walking over there? I don't 
see anybody. Well, my name is Patty, and this is my friend Emmy, and we came a long ways to come to this town to see the battleship. And we are staying right down the road from this little cemetery here. We decided to come over here and check it out. So we would be very happy and honored if you would speak with us and tell us anything you want to tell us, really. How many of you are there? Um, is there anything you'd like to say at all about your experience when you were here on Earth? A laborer. You were a laborer. Supply. Laborer of supply, okay. Awesome. What do you do now over there on the other side? Turning on the PSP7 for just a couple minutes. Hi there. Catherine? Can you come through and tell me your name? How did you die? No, well, a lot of you died so very young. Can you, can you say the name of the town that we're in? What was that that just flew over my head? Can you tell me? Did you see it and hear it? Thank you so much for talking to me lost. through that. Lost? Somebody lost? I hear some people walking around here somewhere. Kind of loud. You can continue to speak with the Alice box over there on the bench. It will tell us what you're saying. I also have this device right here, and if you get close to it, it will go off. Can you come over here by me? Get in front of me. Yeah. 
Christ. Fist. Did any of you die in a war? I'm hoping that I could possibly see one of you on camera. Even though you're not in the physical world, it is possible. Whoa. What the hell happened? It's like a light just went off or something behind me. It, it is, it's fun. Yes, it is fun. Tom. Tom? It is possible to hear and see you guys even though you're not here there's another one of them planes boy they're just going out tonight slave what slave slave yeah See or feel anything over that way? Over there in that corner. I'm still feeling in that, in that corner. I know, me too. That's where I feel the most. I mean, we can go back over yeah, there. It's just there's people right in that room. Coming? There's a few people in there. They must be having some type of meeting. Straight ahead. You watch it straight ahead over there. Yeah. It felt weird. Okay. That's where I shined the flashlight, but that corner. Do you know what the name of this cemetery is? I don't. We'll have to it's look. Not Okay. Oh, shoot. Just said war. Wow. Goes off at all. Is there anybody here? There's graves all the way up next to the building. They're everywhere.
definitely feel something in this corner over here. Oh, okay, it just went off and I walked right through here. Let me do this again. So, as I was walking through here, this went off. Mm. Of course, now it's not going to do it. I definitely feel something over there in that corner. Yeah, that corner is the heaviest. I don't think it's anything bad, but I think that the spirits, whoever's buried in that corner or somebody is, their presence is, is being felt. Yep, we're gonna go ahead and head out. We got a lot of filming to do. Oh, information. Right, after I, no, I just <laughs> We have a lot of filming to do. We're actually gonna be filming in the um, bed and breakfast tonight. Tomorrow night we're filming at the USS North Carolina Battleship and um, possibly the Bellamy House that's in this area as well. So we got a lot to do. This was just kind of a little bonus thing. I don't know which one you're going to see first, but uh, when I get ready to put it out, which might be a week or two later, because uh, I'm kind of behind in videos right now, um, I've still got videos from Tennessee to put out. So I don't know when you'll see it. It might be a couple weeks and we will be home when you see this. We won't be here anymore. But thank you so much for watching, and I hope that we caught something on camera. This place is beautiful. It's it just came on by itself yes. again. Is the button easy to push or something? Nick. Nick? Oh, wow. Huh. I guess I'll keep this one as my walk out, too. Yeah, keep it on. Bye. It was such an honor to see these very very old graves look at this 1787 i just can't get over i can't even imagine what it must have been like in 1700s wow all right rest in peace it's been an honor coming here and seeing these graves and seeing this beautiful church. Look at that. That is beautiful. Look at those windows. Hey, watch out, there's a step there. Okay. So see, the gate was open, um, which means come on in. I mean, they didn't want anybody coming in. It wouldn't be open. So it's, it was open. That's why we went in. And a dogwood tree. I've never seen a dogwood tree in person until this trip. It's beautiful. Bye.